Hello guys, welcome to my vlog. I've been recording this beginning of vlog for ages and I just stopped in the middle of the day. I kept sabotaging myself, I kept uh, creating this different things to do and reason why I shouldn't record this video. So sorry for that, sorry I put aside YouTube for like two weeks and haven't posted any workouts and any vlogs. I'm back and I really hope that I will do it again consistently. I make rosemary oil and rosemary water at one time. I take fresh rosemary, soak it in water. You can use soda as well, it's up to you. Next, I wash the rosemary and dry it well with paper towels. I grab part of the rosemary and put it in the pan and cook for about 15 minutes. Then water cools down into a glass jar with a couple of drops of mint oil and use it anytime. The second part of rosemary I pour with extra virgin olive oil and keep it in a water bath until the oil heats up about 15 minutes. Next I put this rosemary in a jar and pour in on top with this heated oil. from the gym as you can tell and I will do scalp massage and scalp oiling about life updates we have a lot of work right now I have contract with this guys who asked me to record lots of workouts for them and I'm working on this also we are starting one new project with my husband and about this I will tell you a bit later a lot is going on and also we are getting ready for our wedding which is be um, end of September in Greece also I've been struggling with massive hair loss uh, I don't know the reason I think it's either stress levels or uh, just my recovery from my illness recently or it's body water. A lot of people have been complaining about their face problems and hair problems because of this water. So I started drinking vitamins, I started doing hair oiling and hair like massages and masks and also we put water filter on our shower. So it's slowly getting better. I see really good improvement in my hair loss and now I will work on them to grow, to shine and to be more thicker. Also I'm trying to drink lots of water and also I increase levels of my protein intake. I've seen somewhere that marine collagen is really marine collagen peptides is really good for your hair. Okay, um, let's do hair oiling. I have this bowl of olive oil and the rest I had like fresh rosemary as you can see. I put it there and it was there like for a week and then it is ready to, to use, ready to go. Also I'm mixing this with tea tree oil, peppermint oil, jojoba, I think I <laughs> pronounced correctly, oil and with virgin sweet almond oil. I put a little bit of each in one plate because you don't need too much oil because I used to do like really really a lot of oil on my hair and like it was so oily and so gross and then I had to wash them like I don't know five times to get rid of this oil but now I just do like I don't know three or five full like this thing and this is enough for my full scalp and then I just do massage and it just spreads all around. As you can see I don't put a lot and now I will just heat this oil because I really like to use hot oil on my scalp because it gets into my scalp weaker and more effectively. I will get this big pan because I don't have a uh, small left because they are all dirty. I will just put some water inside and I will put this plate also inside and 
I will wait till my oil will be really hot. While I'm doing this, I will grab my scalp massager like this and I will do hair massage because it's really important to activate your scalp before you put oil on this. Make sure that you don't put any dry shampoo, any kind of styling on your hair before you're doing your scalp oiling because your oil just couldn't get there so make sure you just use it on your scalp as it is I will just use a massage for like, I don't know, 5 to 7 minutes maybe I will do it Sometimes I will do it with my hands, sometimes I will do it with my brush. After I preheated my oil and did scalp massage, I will just grab some random empty dropper and I will use this to apply oil on my scalp. Be careful. And when you try your oil, for example, on your finger, you always feel it more than you will do on your scalp. Keep that in mind. I just press a little bit and just move the dropper all around my scalp. And the last drops of oil I will use uh, on my hands. Just spread them all around and I will put them on my legs, on my hair. And then you have to massage your scalp again to activate your oil, to activate your scalp. Her for like follicles, follicles. I usually do this hair oiling, scalp oiling twice a week, and with that you have to be really consistent, like with the other stuff as well. And then the fun part, what? I will collect all my hair, so it looks really fun. Like I'm preparing myself to, I don't know, put some fake hair. And then I will just put my towel on my hair. And ideally you want to be with this around two to four hours. I never go to sleep with my oil scalp. You don't have to do this, but you really have to wait. At least go with this for around 30 minutes. 